Calvin, pass me the ball. I'm feeling red hot. Green light. Yes. Let's go. Oh my god. I am the definition of a sharpshooter. They should deploy me in Iran. <laughs> hey, pumpkin. How's my little superstar doing? I came in here to remind you that me and you are going school clothes shopping in about 25 minutes. Some mother and son time. Oh my god, I can't wait. I suggest you wrap up your little deal here so we can get going on time. One second, boys. Mom, what the fuck? You think I want to go school clothes shopping with you? Are you drunk? My god. You know what I would rather do? I'd rather take this Beats Pill speaker and shove it up my asshole. Get out of my room and go do my laundry. I'm back, boys. Mom, can we get some McDonald's on the way home, please? God damn it, Aaron, I swear to God, if you ask me one more time, I'm going to do what Ray Rice did to his girlfriend in the elevator, and you're not going to like that. We have food at home. Don't ask again. <laughs> Shut up, Mom. If you decide to go home right now and not take me to McDonald's this instant, I'll just go walk up to Dad and tell him the guy that's been coming over and messing you up in the sheets when he's not around. Then when he leaves you, you'll have nothing because you're an unemployed piece of shit. You'll be homeless. So I suggest we go to McDonald's right now. Thank you, Mommy. I'm a late bloomer third year on the scene. 20 racks don't feel like nothing to me. Came from the streets and I turned to a beast. Invisible set diamonds hug in my piece. God damn it, Aaron. Quit using that foul language. It's ridiculous. You're making me and your mother look bad when we're in public and you have your headphones in talking about sex, money, and drugs. Knock it off right now. Wish I was adopted. Shut the fuck up, Dad. If anything, you're an embarrassment to me. Because whenever someone asks what you do for a living, I have to tell them that you make minimum wage working 9 to 5 at Taco Bell. God, quit worrying about me listening to some new Nav and Gunna and Travis Scott and worry about getting a gym membership. You're literally 320 pounds, you chubby, overweight fuck. Everything burning around me, I'm lit. She gave an attitude, I swap out the bitch. I spent 250, don't know where it went. I just laughed that scumbag for the second time this race. He's probably crying in this room right now. He's so ass. After this race, though, guys, we gotta do another deal with Demi Lovato. She buys from us, like, every time. We're gonna be filthy rich. We're gonna be swimming in money. Hey, sport. How's it going? Um, I was wondering if you'd like to come outside with me and... <coughs> play some throwing of the baseball into the mitt. Um, it'd be a great father and son experience, and, uh, it's some great weather outside. One second, boys. Dad, if we do some throwing right now, I'm gonna throw your ass in a hospital bed because you probably got fucking coronavirus for crying out loud. Get out of my room and don't come near me. I don't want to be infected by that shit. God. I'm back, boys. <clears throat> Mom, I don't know about this. This is risky. I'm scared. Aaron, we're going to Walmart and back here. There's nothing to worry about. Calm down. Mom, we're supposed to be in containment right now. That's what CNN 10 said. God, I don't want to go to Walmart and get the fucking virus. Fuck. Aaron, calm down. Your chances of getting the coronavirus are so small. It's smaller than Little Honey's downstairs area. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, I'm staying in the car though, Mom. Fuck! Oh my god, mommy, I can't wait for this new iPad. My friends are gonna be so jealous of me. It's gonna be great. Aaron, honey, remember we're getting the Kindle Fire HD Plus. It has all the features the iPad does, and it's half the price. It's just as good as the iPad, okay? Mom, do not screw me over again. I swear if I have to bring that shitty Kindle whatever the fuck to school, everybody's gonna think we're on welfare. My God, everybody knows anything but Apple is stupid. 
I swear if we don't go get this iPad right now, I'll go tell dad about Mark. Then when he finds out, he'll divorce your dumb ass and you'll have nothing because you don't have a job. I suggest we go get this iPad right now. Thanks, Mom. Alright, everybody. As you can see, we have a new student in the classroom. Aaron, would you like to introduce yourself? What's up, motherfuckers? What's up? We vibing. What's up? Oh, Aaron, uh, calm down with that language. We don't like to use that in our classroom. Uh, would you like to tell us a little bit about yourself? Um, what does your mom and dad do for a living? Yeah, uh, my name's Aaron, double A. Don't wear it out. <laughs> um, my dad actually works nine to five at Taco Bell. And uh, my mom doesn't really have a job. Uh, I like to refer to her as an unemployed piece of shit. So, uh, if you guys ever need me, just give me a tap on the shoulder, because I'm not going to be able to hear you, because <laughs> my AirPods in, so, uh, you yeah. know. it out, West, yeah! Mom, can we get a sausage burrito from McDonald's, please? Aaron, they don't even have breakfast right now. It's like 2 o'clock. But, Mom... It's all day, every day at McDonald's. They have sandwiches and breakfast burritos 24 hours. You know what, Aaron? There's food at home. You have salami and cheese sandwiches in the fridge. If you ask me again to go out to eat, there's going to be trouble. Mom, if you don't go get me this sausage burrito right now, there's going to be trouble for you. You know why? Because I'll just go walk up to Dad and tell him what I found in your room yesterday when he was at his work meeting. Two guys in there with nothing on, just chilling in your bedroom. You are disgusting. I suggest we go get this burrito from McDonald's right now. Thank you, Mommy. I'm upset. 15000 on my head is disrespect. So much money that I had to double check. <laughs> Aaron, uh, your father's trying to drive. Uh, keep it down. Slinging out west. Yeah, shoddy. He says she want to suck on the tip. Aaron, quiet down back there. God damn. I understand that you like your new birthday present, and that's great and all, but your father is trying to drive. Oh, my God. Dad. I didn't even hear what you just said, but it was probably something dumb as shit. So I'm glad I didn't have to hear it. All I'm trying to do is use my new birthday present that I got yesterday from mom. Someone who actually loves me in the family. When these are in, dad, your lips are silent, closed shut. And if not, there's going to be trouble. I suggest you leave me alone. Slanging out west, yeah. Can't wait to see the look on Tayshawn's stupid face after I have the AirPods and he doesn't. <laughs> Fucking moron. Interesting packaging you did for the AirPods, Mom. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to wear these in school. Everyone's gonna be so jealous of me. <gasps> Mom! What the fuck are these? Aaron, honey, calm down. Those are the same thing as the AirPods, but they're half the price. They have the same sound quality, I promise. Shut up, Mom! Everyone knows the off-brand stuff is cat shit! If I go to school with these on, everyone's gonna think I'm on welfare! God damn! I'm not gonna get screwed over for my birthday. If we don't go to Target right now and get the AirPods, I'm gonna go walk up to Dad and tell him about John! The guy that's been coming over and messing you up in the sheets when he's not around! <laughs> Thank you, Mommy!